Thank you so much for clicking this video. This is Bart of Pithola. My name is Mujola Olu and I'm super thrilled to be here once again. This is the 30th day of June 2023. I'm filming this video today and uh, it's been about one week exactly since this channel became three years old. I started this channel June 2020, just a little after or during the COVID-19 uh, pandemic you know when I was in my household up and I really just wanted to talk about law and I had the inspiration the instruction to start the channel and I'm so glad you know happy about how far the channel has come the many lives that's been uh, affected by the channel I see your comments I see your emails I see your referrals I see how you talk to your friend you know a friend was in my office the other day and he was telling me that he went to a, another person's house a friend's house it was pretty unbelievable, you know, but this is what he said anyways. He said he went to the friend's house and when he got in, the TV was on and it was part of with a lot on the TV. I was like, oh, so someone put on their TV and all they wanted to watch was part of with a lot also. And are they watching YouTube on a TV instead of on their phones? I know you can do that. I'm just, I was just interrogating, you know, that fact because this person is my friend anyway, so I'm allowed to do that. But I'm just trying to say that I really appreciate how excited you guys have been about the channel and the feedback that you give to me because it's one thing to be excited about it to be happy to support it's another thing you know to give me feedback i've had someone tell me on the channel that they were going to make me an intro video for free although i had to turn it down because i really didn't want to do intro videos i wanted to start talking you know delve into the law immediately i start any video and i've even had some people make comments on the channel for a few videos that i had to you know do a little preamble and make some announcements and they have said that oh the announcements are too much you are derailing too much or oh, you're saying or oh, you're saying too much this the introduction is too long can't you just uh delve into the matter so <laughs> you know different uh, interests. We're balancing competing interests, but I just want to say I'm really grateful. I am really grateful. I'm grateful for people who saw that I started with uh, audio and said, come on, put your face in it. I did not want to put my face in it. I'm grateful for people who said, take this money, use it for the channel. People who have directed me so far, I'm grateful for my family members. <laughs> people who specifically tell me I've watched this video, I've liked this video, you know. People who say, I found your channel. This video was uh, very helpful to me, you know. So many supporters. I'm really grateful. I'm grateful for the different nationalities that have converged, you know, on this channel from Kenya, from Cameroon, from Ghana, you know, the United Kingdom, you know, the United States, you know, people that have uh, indicated where they are from and how the channel has helped them i'm really 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 grateful that i have this platform and i do not take your support and your uh company in, on this journey for granted and i hope that as we go into now we're joining up to the fourth year we're going to do even much more you know talking about law for the layman for the law student and for the lawyer thank you thank you thank you so much so uh, about uh, seven or eight days ago I put out a form where I asked you to give me feedback on the channel so what I want to do in this video is just to shout out to everyone that filled that form I got eight responses exactly so I want to read out what you have said to me and probably what I intend to do with it or how it makes me feel so please come along I got the first response from um, a lady called Vivian I asked what's your name she said Vivian from Nigeria of course and uh well she didn't answer how she found me what year what led her to the channel you know <laughs> but uh i said what's the one video playlist or series that did or does it for you on the channel and she said how to announce appearance in a nigerian court i'm guessing that vivian is a young lawyer i am a young lawyer as well but what i, I try to do is that when i have done something or gone through a process you know as a lawyer i try to document it if you know me in real life, you know that I document my experiences a lot. I put it on WhatsApp status. I used to put it on LinkedIn when I was on LinkedIn. I put it in stories. I put it everywhere because I just feel that when you share uh, your experiences, it provides a guiding light for other people. Just the way that other people's experiences, you know, have been guiding light. have been a guiding light for me at one point or the other in my life. So Vivian says that... Uh, uh, the video that does it for her is how to announce appearance in the Nigerian court. I love that video as well. I recorded it on a Friday, on a Friday in 2021. I still remember that. I recorded it on that day. How I learned how to announce my own appearance was that after my uh, 
college, I, uh, that's university, I had to stay home for a year because my school had missed out on uh, the law school admission for that year. So we all in my class had to stay home for a year. So I interned with a law firm. It was gratuitous. They didn't pay me a dime. <laughs> uh, my dad just said, go to this law firm, go and intern there. You can't be sitting at home. So I used to follow them to court. It was a very busy firm. And uh, I learned how people announced their appearances. And I just picked up the one that the principal partner, uh, the, the, owner, the, the owner, the one he uses. And that's what I've used till date. But in that video, I try to uh, talk about how some other people announce their appearances from what I've seen and heard, you know, and experienced. And I hope that as many young lawyers need to do this, they will find these videos very helpful. And, uh, you know, just as uh, Vivian has found it. So I said, how can I do better? Vivian says, just keep doing what you do. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Vivian, for taking our time to respond to this short, you know, form. Thank you very much. I have another response from... Bartholomew, that's a very interesting name. It's a Bible name, it's very uncommon. I like it. Bartholomew from Nigeria as well. My Nigerian people, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. not too, they love me. Thank you, thank you so much. So, Bartholomew said he found me on YouTube in 2021, and uh, that was how to move a counter a feed of it. I remember that video too. I shot in 2021, I remember it, how to move a counter a feed of it. I think that 2021 was the year that I started moving a lot of counterfeit of it because of uh, the change in my law practice. You know, my new job required me to respond to a lot of motions. So I said, let me document this experience. And I'm glad that people found it useful. So I said, what's that one playlist that does it for you or that did it for you on the channel? So there's no response there. Maybe it's how to move a counterfeit of it. It meant to put there. That he has already put up so then i said how can i do better he said more of commercial litigation aspect or agreements okay 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 so the thing is i noticed too that you know i'm more tilted towards the areas of law that i actually practice more it doesn't mean that i don't have a firm grip on other aspects of law it just means that these are things that excite me. These are things I need to do just minimal video research on because, you know, I do them every day and every other day. But uh, I've also uh, done uh, a handful of videos on commercial litigation. I've done something on higher purchase, I remember. I've done something on... Uh, uh, contracts you know the features of a contract i do a lot on a labor and employment law and i'm still going to do more on labor and employment law by the way because it's one of my areas of specialization and uh uh off the top of my head i can't remember now but if i do when i'm editing the video i'm going to put you know some of the commercial litigation or commercial law uh matters uh videos that i have done so commercial litigation uh, uh agreement is not exactly an area of law that my work requires, my day job, that's what I mean by my work at the moment. That's why it doesn't feature that much. But uh, I'm interested in that area of law as well, and I will try to do more. I'll try to bring more people. I brought someone who talked to us about business registration in Nigeria and corporation of a company, you know. Please watch that video. I believe that's commercial. I've done, uh, I talk about property law a lot. That's commercial uh, litigation as well. Uh, and I brought someone who talked to us at length about property transactions in Nigeria. So what I'll do is either I'll do more of these videos or I'll bring subject matter experts who would also come to us and talk, who will come and talk about these things. So thank you for that, Bartholomew. Then I have uh, feedback from a person called Stanley from Nigeria. So Stanley, I said that what's the one video that does it for you? He said all of the videos. Thank you, Stanley. Then I said, uh, how can I do uh, better? He said, teach more on Court of Appeal proceedings. Okay, okay. I will put that in mind. There's a video on civil appeals, you know, that I've done and I've talked about criminal appeals a lot too in some of the videos. Please watch those videos, but I will keep this uh, feedback in mind. Thank you, Stanley. The next, uh, uh response i have is from loveth <laughs> madam loveth madam loveth is my first female uh principal i say is because she's still my principal she's a very 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 wonderful senior she's my first principal post call i spent a year in a law firm 
and I'm technically still part of her love frame because it's like I never left. So she has been a huge support to Batok with Ola. Shout out to you, Madam Lovett. If you're watching this video from anywhere, just help me tell her thank you. Just let me tell her thank you in the comment section. Thank you, thank you so much. I do not take for granted what you do for me. She's uh, a, a senior that's very passionate about self-development and she's always pushing me, do this, do that. Have you seen this? She sends me links. She sends me opportunities. Oh, apply to this. Oh, this is what you should now do. And you know, all those things I'm really, really grateful. And she says that uh, she has a law firm Gede Chambers, Lovet, Osas and Co. It's in Benin City, Edo State. It's, and uh, they do a lot of transactions, property transactions, commercial litigation, you know, family law, criminal law, all different aspects of law. And she's really, really good at what she does. And she carries clients matter on her head, like Fred Plantin. So you know that once she gets your brief, she's going to take it very serious. Madam Lovet. So I'm going to link her email. I want to do that. I'll link her email in the description box. So if you ever watch this video and you need the services of a lawyer in those aspects of law that I mentioned, she also does uh, immigration law, you know, very good at it. And several other aspects that I cannot mention now, but if you see the email and you have a legal challenge, maybe you're in a do state or you just need, because she's not limited to a do state, you can just contact her. She's really, really good at what she does. So uh, she says she found my channel in 2020. Of course, that's the year that I started. <laughs> She knows when I started the channel. And she says, what's the one video playlist or series that does it for you? That does it for you on the channel. She says, all the videos. Oh, thank you so much. And how can I do better? You're doing well. Ah, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. So I have another response from uh, someone called uh, Toby. Yeah, Toby is from Nigeria as well. And... Uh, I said that, how did you find me? She said, I did find you on Twitter, he or she now. Toby, thank you so much. This is, my, this is the first person that says that they found me on Twitter, in this form, of course. There have been other people that found me on Twitter who have let me know that, oh, I found your Twitter, oh, I traced your uh, channel from Twitter. And uh, Twitter family, they are wonderful family. They retweet, they like the things I do. They engage with my law, you know, talks on Twitter. And when I post the videos, you know, or links to the videos, they share them. And they watch them. They leave me comments on the channel from time to time. Thank you. Thank you so much, my Twitter family. So um, I said, how did you find me? She said, I follow, she or he now said, I follow a number of lawyers. So your page popped up as a feed around 2022. Thank you. Then I said, what's that one video that does or did it for you? Playlist or series on the channel. He said, the one on tendering evidence, documentary evidence to be precise. I came across it in a period when I needed to know how electronic generated evidence was tendered. So it meant a great deal for me. Ah, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I think that the kind of interactions or engagement that I've been getting on electronic evidence section 84 have, have been uh, very wonderful. Where even from sen a senior lawyer, I got uh, a response that really uh, served as an encouragement that made me so happy that I recorded that video. Section 84 is still very controversial in Nigeria. It's about tendering and the admissibility of uh, electronically generated evidence. So if you haven't watched the video, please watch it. Uh, so thank you, Toby. I'm glad for this feedback. So I said, how can I do better? I said, please do videos on company law. Thank you. Why do you all want to talk about company law and company law and commercial litigation? I read. I will try my best to do that. Thank you, thank you. So I have another response from MK. MK is from Nairobi, Kenya. Finally, another country. So thank you, thank you so much. MK, I often see your uh, engagements, uh, interactions on the channel. I see your feedback, your comments that you leave on the videos and I'm really grateful. I'm appreciative of that. Nigerian law and Kenyan law are very similar. In fact, I want to start interrogating Kenyan law and Kenyan uh, legal system more these days. You know, I, uh, I talked about a judgment that I read where, about marital property, you know, uh, not too long ago on Twitter and uh, it was just uh, very similar to uh, marital property in Nigeria which I've done a video about last year so I'm really happy about that. Thank you, MK, for all your comments that you leave me on the channel and for watching the videos. Thank you. So I said, uh, what's the one video playlist or series that did your dossier for you? He said, how to move emotion. 
yay then i said how can i do better he said as always keep everything simple thank you so much this is one comment that i keep getting from people on the channel they say that i break it down i make it so simple for them to understand honestly that is my goal there's no need to uh you know uh, bamboozle people with uh, nebulous nomenclature once we can understand each other and communicate it's uh, very important to keep it like that so that you're getting value and i'm um, uh, it's easy for me to also pass the value. So thank you MK. Thank you all the way from Kenya. Then I have another response from um, Stanley. Stanley is from Portacourt River State, Nigeria. We're back to Nigeria. So Stanley says, I found. I said, how did you find me? What year? What led you to me? Uh, I found you on YouTube. Stanley found me on YouTube in May 2022. Very precise. Thank you. So it's been a year now, Stanley. Happy anniversary. A year and a month, actually. He said, I'm a law graduate awaiting law school by October, November. I'm always on the net surfing for legal information because of my passion for law. And then I stumbled on your numerous videos where you explain how court proceedings are conducted. Since then, I've been an addict on your channel. Madam, you are good at what you do teaching and explaining the law oh thank you so much stanley thank you thank you thank you do black people blush people with dark skin do they blush can you see me blushing <laughs> thank you so much stanley i'm really happy i'm excited each time i run into people who are thirsty for knowledge because the more you learn the better your life becomes and it's so uh immeasurable because you will not even know that you're getting better but your output gets better if your input gets better i hope someone understands that so thank you stanley so i said what's that one video playlist or series that does or did it for you on the channel he said i can't throw any of your videos away all are very good and useful with interest in litigation i want to build up my tactics and antics so your recent video on batna and whatna got me yay and coincidentally i'm writing a book on mediation it's going to come out next month hopefully by god's grace that's july it's uh i'm just documenting my experience as a mediator but it's uh really not just about the stories now but about the practice and procedure of mediation uh so uh i hope you buy it and read it uh i have uh, written something on batna what not today that's why i'm referencing it so um he said also more recently was a video i watched on matters for mention for hearing for final written addresses for ruling for judgments this video is uh uh ask me anything it's one of the ask me anything legal videos you know someone asked a question on uh what case how to know what cases are for and this is very confusing for many young lawyers i know that because i've been through the motions so nobody really pays attention to or teaches you these things you know i'm being very careful i'm not saying they don't teach us good enough or well enough at law school but you know some of these things it's until you encounter them you get to court and you see that your matter is for mention you're wondering what do they mean by for mention am i supposed to get up and mention it what's what's really going to happen and then you see the court asking maybe an SAN that's in court that mention your matter and then you think oh does that mean i can also get up and mention my matter no that's not what it means so watch that video if you haven't so someone asked a question and i addressed it by doing that video and that's one of the most watched videos on the channel which means that it's very useful and helpful for people so i'm glad stanley that you have referenced it he said what caught me on that video was where you said that even though your matter is stated in the course list for mention some judges will want the matter to be heard once both parties and their counsel are in court that is very true especially for criminal matters if your criminal matter is for mention prepare to open your case or to go to trial or continue trial or prepare to open your case or to go to trial that day even if it's a civil matter if uh, the parties are ready the witnesses are in court the courts will go on despite the fact that it's for mention so there's no delay why not so um meaning you should always go to court prepared mm? i jumped the gun stanley already said everything so in fact you teach from the standpoint of experience keep it up thank you so much i appreciate this feedback and i will keep it in mind so i say how can i do better he said you're already good at it however you can bring in seasoned practitioners on specialized areas of the law at intervals or once a while the lawyer you brought recently who answered questions on due diligence on land matters is indeed an expert he drove me back to my land law materials and practice that session drove me crazy i remember that the lawyer is a kendi bolade esquire is my one year senior at the bar and he was my senior secondary school so uh, i think the year we did the video was 2021 
yes i remember it because we had been shifting dates you know his convenience my convenience and uh you know that day i went to a wedding i just came back i think it was at the wedding was messaging me and said that oh let's shoot this video today is free so i said okay let's do it so as soon as i got back from the wedding i i sat down and we recorded that session and i'm so glad that stanley is referencing it it is one session that i wish that everyone who watches this channel who has an interest the remotest interest in property transactions whether as a buyer, as a seller, as a lawyer, or what have you, or as an agent, would watch. Bolade is really good at what he does. And I know this because I have watched that session over again. Property transactions, he really broke it down. If you want to be safe with your property transactions in Nigeria, watch that session. I'll try to link all the videos referenced in the description box, but I hope that you can look for them and watch them. As always, if you want to look for a video on the channel, just... Uh, Put a, a keyword from the video and say that part of it allah so if you could say part of it allah for mention if you want a video that talks about what uh your matter what what it means when your matter is for mention for instance so thank you bola dear our guest thank you for enriching the viewers and thank you viewers for watching as well so we have one last response from someone called joshua from anambra state nigeria yay and we end in Nigeria. So Joshua says he's a law student from Inamdi Azikwe University. That's Unizik. Shout out to Unizikites. Is that what they call them? Shout out to you guys. So he said, I found you on YouTube. I said, which of the videos does it for you? He said, all of them actually. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Joshua. I'm so happy. Then he said, how can I do better? He said, video quality. Okay, I would have loved that maybe you break this down, but Thank you for mentioning that. I'll keep it in mind. I always try to make sure that the videos get better by the day. But uh, there are times when I just feel like, oh, we cannot wait until we have the best quality. I got to shoot. I got to talk about this aspect of law. And people got to watch this. They need this. I need to say this to them. And so I just go ahead, notwithstanding. But I will keep that in mind. Thank you to everyone that has filled uh, the form eight of you i love you thank you very much i love you for filling the form i love you for following battle with Ola for the support and for the feedback i will act on it as uh, much as possible and i will see you in my very next video as we go up to the fourth year on the channel i hope you keep subscribing liking the videos leaving comments uh sending mails to us at gmail.com when necessary and i hope that if you also need legal consultation paid legal consultation now so that i can uh, draw up or consult with you uh to come up with tailored you know personalized legal solutions apart from the general law speak you would pay for a session using the link in the description box and we would be able to add value to each other that will be all for now i will see you in my very next video don't forget to subscribe to do and please keep sharing the videos bring more people on the channel it's much more than money that you can give to the channel if you bring more people they bring more people and more people keep bringing more people let's spread the word to those